Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever you are in the world. Thank you so much for joining. My beautiful wife is here back with us today, and I'm going to check out something that a recent video introduced me to, which is called field hockey. Have you ever heard of the sport field hockey, babe? Yeah. You have? Yes. Wow. Well, apparently the United States has a field hockey team. I've never heard of field hockey. But we're going to watch Netherlands versus USA Week 13. Women's FIH Pro League Highlights. Really? So you know how, how field hockey works? I don't really know how it works. I've just heard of it in like several different movies and TV shows. Hmm. Wait, you know what? Doesn't uh, American Pie, the movie, don't they play field hockey in the movie? I don't remember. It's been so long since I've Or seen is it movie. lacrosse or something? It's probably lacrosse. I don't know. It's been so long. Anyways, <laughs> let's see what this is all about. Let us know how this sport works in the comments below. Someone told me that this sport is for rich people in the Netherlands. Interesting. Someone told me that in the comments. I don't know if that's true. I mean, but... like, most of the movies that I've seen of it, it's like usually at some private school. Yeah, so exactly. Like, kind of they said <laughs> they said it was like golf or like tennis, like kind of like a that yeah. kind of thing. And that most people watch football. Football as in soccer. Football as in soccer. Okay, here we go. By the way, you'd be surprised to know that a lot of the sports videos I do get blocked. So hopefully this doesn't get blocked. We'll see. It's a very good afternoon, everyone. And welcome to Rotterdam as the Women's World Champions look to secure back-to-back -back home wins in the Pro League. They put China to the sword in Utrecht in midweek. How will the United States fare here today? Here we go, then. It's the United States to get us underway. But early possession here, looking to come through the middle. Hold on, let me see if I can turn the quality up. Because it's kind of hard to see. <clears throat> so, so far it kind of looks like hockey. But on a field. But on a field. <laughs> and it looks much bigger than a hockey field. And Martin, will it work out to try and get a shot away? And they do, and... In the end, it's a very good piece of goalkeeping. Fired in, in it goes. And an opportunity here. And it's found its way in. And after all of that early pressure, it is the United States who have struck first. Taylor West with the final touch. It was a, a scrappy finish in the end. <laughs> yeah, she got smacked. Plenty of defensive work again here, but the shot's on! And there is the leveler. Brutal finish. And the Netherlands strike back. The gap just opened up. And the that was a nasty shot. I think the TV show that I that they play field hockey in a lot is awkward. Hmm. Awkward. <laughs> the finish was sublime. Here comes the injection. And there comes the strike and acrobatic stuff <laughs> from Kelsey Bink. To make things happen, just about has the legs to get... Okay, where does the United States even find these field hockey players? Because I've never met anyone in this country who plays field hockey. So mm -hmm. I am so confused. We live in Texas. I feel like field hockey is not a thing in Texas. Yeah. They're like, it's like one of those things like lacrosse. Like, nobody plays lacrosse in Texas. But they'll play it in Colorado. Mm -hmm. A lot of people play it in Colorado. And it's in, probably like in certain states. In Texas, it's all about football. And baseball. American football. To this near side for Gibby Janssen. He plays it into the center. Oh, it's a, a lovely, lovely goal. Taken so well, creeping in that corner. And the Netherlands have turned this around. Defensively for the United States to 
Stay firm, but here's the bar. And she gets the shot away. Oh, my word. Well, Kelsey Bing went flying to her right. But no goalkeeper was going to get anywhere near that. That was devastating. Ready to... Three to one. United States is getting crushed. Go of the Netherlands. Here's the injection. And the strike towards goal again was on target. Devant's there. She wants a hat trick today. But she is once more. And it goes wide and the Americans are able to survive. Coming oh. forward with purpose again at the Netherlands. Yeah, maybe you guys can let us know. Is there just one goal? Yeah, like it keeps... I don't know if it's because we're watching the highlights, but it feels like... I feel like it's not like a normal field where there's like two goals on both sides. But I don't know. It could just be because we're watching the highlights and not seeing them go down the field. Yeah, it's hard to tell. I've... Coming forward with purpose again at the Netherlands. Forced wide though. In comes the cross and right across it goes. It's still on. And it will work out for a fourth goal for the Netherlands. It came right back off. Ayanna McLean. And this is going to get referred. So Luring taking it on. as it drops so nicely it's not going to count what's not allowed yeah we don't know the rules on the turn that's true they have got their fourth goal this one will count this whole time I've just been trying to compare the Dutch women versus the United States women to try to see if the Dutch women are taller. It's hard to tell in these clips, but everyone tells me how tall they are from the Netherlands, and so I've literally just been looking at their height the whole time. I can't tell. I can't tell anything. I'm like barely following what's going on. <laughs> I think well, those, th comparable. those three are pretty, th those three are taller than this girl, I think. Yeah. Because they're further back from her, too, so they should look smaller, right? This one will count! It's a very cool, consummate finish from Fortuyn, who had the freedom of Rotterdam, really. Here he comes. It struck so well, right in that bottom corner. That was an aggressive shot, huh? Yeah, she got that. What, five to goalie one? Can't, goalie can't even see that one coming. Nope. That's five. And it's Yibby Anson. Dangerous and it goes. And struck. And a goal. Oh, my gosh. Well, they all seem to stop. I think they were waiting for a penalty corner to be awarded. But in the end, the Netherlands profiting. The Dutch team is having no mercy right now. <laughs> <laughs> Faced it. It's a, a deflection in there on the reverse. The strike comes in. Oh, and just trickles oh. wide. Oh. The trap is a good one. There's Van Massacre. Born to score Man, from penalty corners, like number 50 in her career. Oh, <laughs> A son of the Dutch just let them score one point in the beginning. And like, is it the U.S. goalie that just keeps going into the splits? Like, how many times can you go into the splits in one game? <laughs> the goalie was probably so sore after this game. Like, that's, that's pretty much. Well and truly shining in Rotterdam and shining down on the Netherlands. That's it. After a, a pretty <laughs> decent start, they fell behind, but how they responded and a, a final score. They didn't even break a sweat. Look at them. <laughs> <laughs> that was just like a warm-up game for the Netherlands. Well...
We need to step up our field hockey game. Yeah. Oh. Against the United <laughs> States, fairly convincing in the end. That was interesting. I did not expect the United States to get murdered. I kind of expected it. Like, off the bat, I was like, oh, impressed that they, like, got the first goal. And then it was downhill from there. Mm-hmm. Well, let us know what we should check out next. Let us know, is field hockey your favorite sport, or do you prefer football or something else? And also, my beautiful wife here has a jewelry line. <laughs> you can uh, check out my jewelry line at uh, etsy.com backslash shop backslash simply shay lux. Um, it's just a line of elegant, simple jewelry. If you want, if you... If you like checking it out, go ahead. <laughs> if it wasn't for this beautiful woman, I wouldn't be able to do any of these videos or anything. So I appreciate all the love you guys have shown me. And if you like nice jewelry, check out her website. I think you'll like it.